This is what we have learned in the last lecture. All right, next, the third one. Cell phone issue, okay. Third one that is cell phone issue. Cell phone issue make your In cell phone issue, you will have, please write here. Chlorine plus concentrated H2SO4. This is going to give me two products. Chlorine, SO3H plus chlorine as it is and SO3H. Again, this is going to be major. This is going to be minor. Okay. Now, whatever is getting attached on the ortho and para position, that is the electrophile. So, right, how the electrophile is formed, formation of SO3H and a positive charge on the sulfur atom, on the sulfur atom. Okay. Now, H2SO4 has a structure in which sulfur contains two double bond with oxygen. And Two single bonds with OH. So for OH, I will show it like this. There are lone pairs from oxygen atom. There will be plenty of H plus ions also because h 2 is a concentrated crystal spot. It is an acid and it will liberate H plus ion. So there will be a plenty of H plus ions, which will be here. Oxygen's lone pair will attack on this H plus ion, and you will get double bond O double bond O, oxygen bonded with hydrogen and another hydrogen. There will be a positive charge because it has donated its electron and formed a bond with hydrogen. That is all. That is why we will have a positive charge. Once the positive charge is <coughs> on oxygen atom, this oxygen cannot bear a positive charge. Why? Because it will become very, 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 very electronegative and so electronegative that it will take all the electrons from the sulfur and leave as water what it will do and it will leave it as water. So whenever you have this type of group, it is a very good leaving group. Okay, so oxygen with a positive charge and two hydrogens. So whenever oxygen will get a positive charge, it will always, at least it will either leave or it will break a bond. And so most probably it leaves as H2O. It leaves as H2O and you will be forming HO bonded to sulfur. As this sulfur has lost its electron, it will get a positive charge here like this, right? And this is the positive charge SO3H, which is attaching on the ortho and para position of chlorobenzene. Is this clear? Yes or no? Please tell me. Kulsum, Krishna, Hamza, Akshay and Hiba. Clear this up? Go? Yes, sir. Yeah. Okay. Today's class can be a bit long. Hai na? So, today we will complete karke Hello, we will complete Hello, Hello, there are 30 conversions. So today and tomorrow the classes will be a bit longer. Last class, I don't Like I took your class only for one hour. That means last Sunday, no? Uh, last Sunday. I had to take for one and half hours, then 30 minutes to test. I forgot that actually. Chale. Done everyone, yes or no? Please tell me. Done, sir. Yes, sir. Okay. Right next. Serial craft alkylation. Just a second. Right. Fourth one. Serial craft alkylation. Here you write the introduction of. Alkyl group. The introduction of alkyl group. Benzene ring. Using appropriate alkylating reagent. Okay. 
in bracket you will write rx you use halo alkene as an alkylating reagent okay use halo alkene as an alkylating reagent is right in the presence of suitable alkali in using appropriate alkylating reagent in the presence of in the presence of a catalyst in the presence of a catalyst is called friedel craft alkylation okay so write a general reaction here what is going to happen i am writing this for benzene okay you have benzene plus alkylating reagent jab aap answer likhega so you will always you will write rx as a alkylating reagent in bracket okay but please remember there are plenty of alkylating reagent that you can use primarily alkyl halides are used but we can also use alcohols there are instances in which we also use ethers okay in which use ethers all of this give me a product where this benzene thing gets attached with r group okay <clears throat> and if you are going to use a aloe then the r group will be attached on ortho and para position i hope you have written the statement write the reactions chlorine plus ch3 br okay so please remember this is the alkyl group which is going to get attached that means ch3 is going to get attached on the ortho position plus the para position now see only please this see you okay okay right ch3 okay Let us look at the mechanism here. Let us look at the mechanism. Okay, I will give you a mechanism of not this one, but for example, if you have something like this, chlorine plus this is what isopropyl bromide. What is this? This is isopropyl bromide. Now, the bond between benzene and alkyl group. is why the carbon atom containing halogen so this carbon is going to attach on the benzene ring okay so it will make the benzene ring with chlorine as it is the structure will be as it is for the ortho position what you will draw you will draw the bond and then you will mark that carbon atom you okay, know this carbon atom has one methyl group and the other methyl group. one methyl group and the other methyl group so this is the ortho product plus Your benzene ring with chlorine as it is in the para position. As you can see, Br has been replaced by Br has been replaced by which car which the whole phenyl group. Yeah, see this is the carbon atom. Okay, is this reaction understood by everyone? Yes or no? The start mark, Akshay Hamza. Yes. Yes. Okay. And you look at the mechanism of this reaction also. Okay, of this reaction only. Come, <coughs> see. So in mechanism, what do we have here? We have. अच्छा, okay, wait, wait, wait. यहाँ पे AlCl3 लिख लीजिए. मैंने तो ये लिखा है नहीं. AlCl3 और any Lewis acid जैसे कि halogenation में होता है. Okay. So here what we will have? We have this isopropyl bromide plus we have here AlCl3. So again, three chlorine atoms. And one vacant pure orbital. This Br will go. It will attach here. And what you will be getting? You will be getting the positive charge. So this positive charge is going to get attached by the benzene ring. Okay. So this positive. This is my 
इलेक्ट्रोफाइल इलेक्ट्रोफाइल में जहां पे भी पॉजिटिव चार्ज देर ओनली वी आर गोइंग टू गेट देर ओनली वी आर गोइंग टू अटैच दी बेनजीन में एट ऑल फॉर पैरा पोजिशन Then everyone is on a piece of me. Done. Sir. Okay. <clears throat> Now write the next reaction. That is, that's it. Which one is that? For me, I'll tell you. Here, okay. For example, if you have this, also write this reaction here, which is important. Let's suppose we have something like this. Br okay plus we have chlorine. तो याद रखिएगा आप लोग please. This will form a carbocation. The carbocation will be like this. Now can you see? Adjacent to carbocation, what do we have here? We have a what do we have here? Three degree carbon. Yes or no? Can you all of you see that? Yes. तो क्या होता है? When the adjacent carbon has three degree, or when the carbon adjacent to carbocation has three degree carbon, then what happens? We have seen this type of case, ma. कुछ याद नहीं आ रहा? याद करने की कोशिश कीजिए क्या होता है? Yes, Akshay, Hamza, Heba, Krishna, Kulsum. कार्बोकटाइन विल बी लाइक दिस ओके दिस इज द कार्बोकटाइन आफ्टर रीअरेंजमेंट आफ्टर रीअरेंजमेंट याद है कि नहीं याद आया ऑल ऑफ यू प्लीज रिमेम्बर तो चीज है ठीक है देखिए ऐसे तो इस तरह के सवाल आते नहीं जल्दी लेकिन दिमाग जब पागल होता है ना सीबीएसई का तो फिर वो इसी तरह के सवाल देता है तो पढ़ाया था हमने पढ़ाया तो था आप लोगों को ना इससे पहले पढ़ाया होगा राइट ठीक है जब आपके पास यहाँ पे थ्री डी तो हाइड्राइड शिफ्ट होगा तो प्रोडक्ट क्या बन जाएगा आपके पास प्लीज रिमेम्बर द स्टेप्स एक बॉन्ड तो आप बना दीजिए ऐसे सीधा ओके देन लुक एट दिस कार्बन आइटम इस कार्बन आइटम के पास इट हैज टू मिथाइल ग्रुप सिविल फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल राइट One methyl group, second methyl group. Then what do we have here? We have ethyl group. That means, sir, say, you have plus. Plus, what do we have here? Cl. This carbon having one methyl group, the other methyl group, and then we have the ethyl group. Done. Sayada Rufia, Assalamu Alaikum. How are you? My name is Sir Hamid. Fine. What happened? Why are you late? Ah, uh, sorry, sir. It was network problem. Okay. Listen, sir.
the introduction of methyl group in the benzene ring using appropriate acylating reagent in bracket we will write what right r cox as it is there okay r cox appropriate acylating agent in the presence of in the presence of catalyst on little craft acylation ठीक है benzene ring this acylating reagent acylating reagent to aur bhi zyada hote hain we will be using acid halides oil halides okay r c o o x or r c double bond o O C double bond O are the same as anhydride. You can also use R C double bond O H aldehyde. We can also use what esters R C double bond O O R. अब वो क्या रखना है बस ये वाला acid halide acid Halide. What groups get attached? This carbon atom gets attached. Okay, and the halogen leaves. So carbon atom with a double bond O and an R group. This is the acyl group. Write this down. Let me know when you're done. Acyl group. What do you have? Acyl group is the carbon with double bond O. And R group, है ना? और जो bond है, it is coming up with what it, the bond is getting formed between carbon of benzene ring and the carbon of what? And the carbon of acyl group. That carbon has double bond O. Don't everyone listen? Please tell me. Done. Sir. Done. Okay. Let me try something else. Now. Same thing. If it is having halogen, then in halogen, what will happen? A cyl group will get attached. C S three, C double bond O, C N. Presence of A L C L three. The acyl group will get attached on the ortho and para position. C N, C double bond O, C S three. ठीक है? Please याद रखिए. The C L similar जैसे C L आपको क्या था? पहले अट कहाँ से attach होता था? इधर जाएगा. C L will attack on this A L C L three. है ना? तो यहाँ पे आपके पास positive charge carbon positive charge यहाँ पे आएगा आपके पास. फॉर्मेशन ऑफ सी एस थ्री सी डबल बॉन्ड ओ पॉजिटिव कैसे हो रहा फॉर्म यू हैव यूर सी एस थ्री सी डबल बॉन्ड ओ सी एल एंड वी हैव यूर ए एल सी एल थ्री सो दिस हाइड्रोजन आइटम्स थ्रू द सिग्मा बॉन्ड And here we have CS3, 
C double bond O, the sigma bond is taken by the chlorine, and we have your positive charge. And this positive charge is getting attached, attacked by the <coughs> benzene ring. Yes, I yes, I mean. yes, say the Rupia Krishna Hamza. Yes, sir. Yes. Is there anyone who is still writing? No. Okay. Now, till now we have seen the orientation of electrophilic substitution reaction. That means orientation means where the electrophile is getting attached. So it is getting attached in ortho and para position. There are two things that you have to remember about SE of alloarene, electrophilic substitution of alloarene. What is the first thing you have to understand? The first thing is the orientation. Okay, orientation. So we know about orientation that ortho and para product. is formed due to resonance, right? Due to resonance, what happens? The electron density at ortho and para position is higher than that of meta position. And that is why we get the ortho and para products. There's another thing which is known as reactivity. Now, reactivity, what does it mean? It means it asks you a question how fast does the reaction happen compared to benzene? What does it ask? How fast reaction happens compared to benzene? Now, what we have seen is that the reaction of the electrophilic substitution reaction of allory is slower than that of benzene. Okay. Now, why is that? This is due to strong minus I of halogen atom. Strong minus I of halogen atom. Okay. So please remember two things. Orientation, it is controlled by controlled by resonance and the reactivity is controlled by minus I. Then yes or no, please tell me. There are two concepts in AC of halorine that you have to understand. No, this is overall AC. Electrophilic substitution reactions. Electrophilic substitution reaction in which we have to understand the orientation of the attack and the reactivity of the uh, halorene. So orientation is such that it is controlled by resonance, but due to strong minus I, that means the effect is strongest in what? In halorene. That is why what do we have? We have slow reaction. 
डन एवरी मेसन ऑफिसर मी लिख लिया सबने व्हाट अबाउट अदर्स हमजा हिबा कुलसुम एनीवन राइटिंग डन सर डन नो ओके फाइन नाउ देयर आर अ फ्यू क्वेश्चन दैट कैन बी आस्क्ड फ्रॉम दिस राइट नोट द नोट यू विल राइट द फर्स्ट थिंग राइट हेलो अरीन सर less reactive towards se towards electrophilic substitution than benzene you will be asked why so what you are going to write you write first thing you will write minus i of halogen is more powerful than a resonance okay next point you will write you see next one due to which electron density on benzene ring decreases बेंजीन रिंग क्या होता है 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 ना हेंस स्टेबिलिटी ऑफ कार्बोकटाइन डिक्रीजेस स्टेबिलिटी ऑफ कार्बोकटाइन डिक्रीजेस लीडिंग टू Last point of the figure. Therefore, therefore, it becomes less reactive towards SE than benzene. Okay. यहां तक ऐसे दिखा सकते हैं यार वी हैव इलेक्ट्रोफाइन दैट हैपेंस लाइक दिस इलेक्ट्रोफाइल गेट्स अटैच हियर यहां पे तो इसके पास सारे बॉन्ड उतनी की उतनी है एक बॉन्ड यहां पे टूट चुका है वी हैव हियर सीएल इट ऑलरेडी हैड फोर बॉन्ड नाउ इट हैज थ्री बॉन्ड दैट इज व्हाई देयर इज अ पॉजिटिव चार्ज हियर है ना दिस क्लोरीन एटम इज पुलिंग द इलेक्ट्रॉन डन यस ऑन ऑपरेशन मी इनिशियल पॉइंट्स देख लिए होंगे आप लोगों ने राइट अब दी अदर क्वेश्चन देख के नास्क यू इस हेलो अरीन सर स्ट्रांग इलेक्ट्रॉन विद ड्राइंग ग्रुप स्ट्रांग इलेक्ट्रॉन विद ड्राइंग ग्रुप बट स्टिल दे गिव ऑर्थो एंड पैरा प्रोडक्ट्स ओके यू हैव टू एक्सप्लेन दिस वन इन द सेकंड यू विल राइट हेलो अरीन सर स्ट्रांग इलेक्ट्रॉन विड्रॉइंग ग्रुप ड्यू टू माइनस आई है ना इट इज व्हाट इट इज ड्यू टू माइनस आई Like here you have to give the reason for both the things. Why it is strong electron withdrawing group and why it is why it is giving ortho and para product. So first of all you have given halogen are electron withdrawing group due to minus I effect. It is electron withdrawing group. But you will write since 
but as they show you can write as they show resonance as they show resonance the electron density is higher at ortho and para position than the meta position than the meta position therefore they give therefore they give ortho and para products right last sentence jo ki sabse important right here more you write here <clears throat> reactivity is controlled by minus i but orientation is controlled by orientation is controlled by resonance effect Done. Done, sir. What about others? Done, sir. Done, sir. Right next, nucleophilic substitution of haloarenes. SNO haloarenes. Okay. First of all, you write. We have seen that haloarenes they don't show SN. Na, they show SE. एक सवाल तो वो था. They will ask you one question. जो कि last class में हम लोगों ने पढ़ा था. क्या पढ़ा था? Haloalkenes show SN, but haloarenes show electrophilic substitution reaction. Why? Now, if you get this question, then you have you will tell me. Why haloalkenes show SN and why haloarenes show SE? ये दो पॉइंट लिखना था आपको. Now if they will ask you, if they will ask you, write this, write this, write this with me. Haloarenes don't show SN at room temperature. SN at room temperature. ठीक है? So please remember. Here we have to give the reason why it is not showing SN, and the previous question it was why it shows SE. Both of this 
these questions are different and they will have different answers dono ko please mix mat kijiyega dono ko please mix mat kijiyega okay so right halorins don't show sn at room temperature due to the following reasons the following reasons number 1 partial double bond on cx bond due to resonance due to resonance what do we have a partial double bond on the cx so you will make a structure okay please show these things chlorine you know we have made the resonating structure i'm just showing that you have to show it here we have a negative charge double bond chlorine and then double and then double here okay partial double bond on cx1 due to resonance the next reason is the next reason instability of phenyl cation instability of phenyl cation now when we have a benzene ring attached to chlorine or any halogen atom then this bond has to break right if this bond is going to break then we will get a positive charge here now this positive charge it is surrounded by all these carbon atoms are what all of these are what sp2 all of these are sp2 sp2 is high in electronegativity if it is high in electronegativity it will abstract more and more electron if it is abstracting more and more electron it is not going to stabilize this so this is what unstable this is unstable this is going to be unstable okay if they are asking na if they will ask you why halorins do not show sn1 sn1 kyun nahi hota tab aap to ye reason ye reason de dijiyega first two partial double bond on cx bond is partial double bond on cx due to resonance to tootega nahi jaldi agar toot bhi gaya so that cation will be unstable all of you understood this yes or no please tell me krishna and kulsum sayada rofia heba hamza bataiye right okay right next third third reason third reason is repulsion between repulsion between electron rich benzene ring and electron rich nucleophile theek hai ye kiska reason hai this is the reason third or fourth jo reason hoga na that will be for sn2 ठीक है तो हम लोगों ने दोनों बता दिया एसएन होने के दो तरीके एसएन कैन ओनली हैपन इन टू वेस एसएन वन एंड एसएन टू व्हाई एसएन वन कैन नॉट हैपन बिकॉज़ ऑफ द बिकॉज़ ऑफ द स्ट्रांग सीएक्स बॉन्ड व्हाई एसएन टू कैन नॉट हैपन बिकॉज़ ऑफ रिपल्शन बिटवीन इलेक्ट्रॉन है ना व्हाट इज देयर वी हैव बेंजीन रिंग एंड अ क्लोरीन एंड अ न्यूक्लियोफाइल न्यूक्लियोफाइल इज आल्सो व्हाट देयर विल बी रिपल्शन इट इज गोइंग टू अटैक बट द इलेक्ट्रॉन डेंसिटी विल रिपेल द न्यूक्लियोफाइल सो द न्यूक्लियोफाइल कैन नॉट अटैक So repulsion between electron rich and benzene ring, electron rich benzene ring and electron rich nucleophile. This is the reason why the attack does not happen in SN two. Okay. Now furthermore, right the fourth point, the sp two carbon of CX does not have. in a partial positive charge to attract electron sorry to attract nucleophile to attract nucleophile hai na so nucleophile will be attracted towards what the delta positive charge wo hai hi nahi yahan pe hai na why because the carbon atom is what it is sp2 sp2 is more electronegative so if it is more electronegative there will be not much there will be not much electronegativity difference 
due to which we get the partial positive and partial negative charge. Okay. So all the four reasons. Everyone got this? Yes or no? Please tell me. Did everyone get the four reasons? The first two reasons are for SN1 specifically. Last two is for SN2 specifically. And all four reasons are for SN in general. All four are for SN in general. Done? Yes or no? Please tell me, guys. Done? So can you repeat three and four again? Three and four? Thank you. Nucleophile is electron rich. Yes or no? Krishna? Yes. So what charge associate ki jayega? Positive or negative? Electron rich nucleophile? Pe? Nucleophile will have what, what kind of charge? Negative. Negative. And benzene rich, benzene ring is also electron rich because it has three pi bonds. Yes or no? Yes, sir. So both of them are will be having negative charges, right? And then that is why they will repel each other. Correct? Yes, sir. Anna, and the fourth point. Take your fourth point, Mikhail. Fourth point. This is sp2. Electronegativity is high. Hydrogen ka bhi electronegativity high. Do high cheese ka difference kya ho jayega? Low? Yes or no? Yes, sir. Ye, ye aapko yaad ho to dipole moment mein samjhaya tha Yes or no? You have done yes, the same sir. thing. Right? Is everyone done? Yes, done. Now, right. So, when will the reactions hote hote hai. This thing never ends. You will write halo arenes becomes reactive towards. Reactive towards SN in following conditions. SN in following conditions. Okay. What is the condition? Number one. Drastic condition. Drastic condition. Drastic condition. What does it mean? Means high temperature and high pressure next by placing electron withdrawing group at ortho and para positions Okay, so now we have seen that when we have electron withdrawing group at ortho and para position, it is going to show SN. So, what is the difference? Ortho, para, and meta. These are three positions. Why nothing happens at meta position? Let us look at that. Right? Case one. Case one. Electron withdrawing group. At ortho position. At ortho position. Now, what is going to happen here? We'll draw the benzene ring first. Please, just go there, please. Okay, don't write now. We have here the benzene ring like this. Make the pi bonds and X. And we will place the electron withdrawing group that is NO2, nitrogen, double bond oxygen. Single bond oxygen. This is a dative bond, if you remember. And then we have a nucleophile. And then we we'll have a nucleophile. Now, this nucleophile will attack on this carbon here, which is having halogen. Now, nucleophile is coming with its own electron. That is why. 
दिस पाई बॉन्ड विल ब्रेक है ना दिस पाई बॉन्ड इज नॉट अटैकिंग सो दिस पाई बॉन्ड कहां जाएगा यहां पे अटैक कर दिया निकल पहले पाई बॉन्ड आ जाएगा इस वाले कार्बन पे ठीक है पाई बॉन्ड विल बी ऑन दिस कार्बन एवरीथिंग विल बी सेम देयर विल बी हैविंग एक्स इसी कार्बन पे न्यूक्लियोफाइल सो इट ऑलरेडी हैड फोर बॉन्ड नाउ इट इज आल्सो हैविंग फोर बॉन्ड this bond is intact this bond is intact this pi bond has broken and it has gone to this carbon atom which is having nitro group oxygen and there here will be having negative charge right here will be having negative charge now you can see what do we have here we have resonance a double bond b single bond c c has a negative charge now look at the electron flow this negative charge will come here make a pi bond With nitrogen and this one of the pi bond will break and it will go to oxygen. Now what is happening? Tell me, is the electron density going away from the ring or it is coming towards the ring? The electron density is going away or it is coming in to the ring. Tell me, in resonance, what is happening? Going away. Going away, right? If it is going away, that means this negative charge will be what? It will be stabilized, है ना? So negative charge. it is on that carbon atom which contains the no2 group nitrogen the double bond oxygen negative and here we have oxygen okay and other things are as it is there's nothing change so what you can see here the negative charge is on that carbon atom which is containing nitro group which is containing nitro group so obviously this negative charge will be what this negative charge will be withdrawn from the benzene ring and it will stabilize the carbon ion here it will stabilize the negative charge okay write the case 2 write the case 2 electron withdrawing group at meta position meta position mein kya hoga oxygen and halogen plus we have nucleophile so nucleophile with electron it is attacking on this carbon atom this pi bond is breaking it is coming on to this carbon atom this x and nucleophile will be on the same carbon atom x nucleophile here we will have negative charge here we have the double bond here we have the double bond and the nitro group is as it is here and double bond o and then oxygen so there is again a chance of resonance this negative charge so you can see double bond single bond negative double single negative so again this pi bond will be formed here and this pi bond will break and form negative charge negative charge forms pi bond and then pi bond forms the negative charge now double bond here double bond here this nucleophile and this x is as it is here we have a negative charge and here we have the nitro group but the tragedy here is what this negative charge is not coming on the carbon atom which is having nitro group again it cannot come there hai na so you have seen this thing if it is not coming on that carbon atom which is containing the nitro group electron withdrawing group that means this electron withdrawing group has no effect on that negative charge it has no effect on that negative charge okay That is why we will write that plus m and minus m. Both of these things, they have nothing to do in the meta position at the meta position. Write the case three. Write the case three. Electron withdrawing group. Sir, can you scroll up? At para position. अच्छा. दिखा नहीं है आपने. Which one? Which one?
डन एवरी वन यस नो डन सर डन नो ओके सर ओके नाउ व्हाट विल हैपन एट द पैरा पोजीशन इन द सेम बिन सेम बिन with the halogen nucleophile interacting on the carbon containing halogen this pi bond breaking and going to this carbon atom forming a negative charge x double single negative nitrogen double bond o single bond so now here you can see that a double bond b Single bond C, the negative charge, so resonance. This is coming here, and this pi bond will be broken, and it will go to this carbon atom here. Now we have X double bond double bond negative charge here, and the same carbon is containing an O two group. Okay. Done yes or no? Please tell me. Done sir. Done na. So this one will be clear after. When electron withdrawing group is placed at ortho and para position. then the negative charge appears on that carbon atom which contains which contains the electron withdrawing group That is N O two, no? Hence, the carbon ion is stabilized. But when e w g group is at meta position is at meta position the negative charge does not appear on the meta position Hence, the carbon ion is not stabilized. Can you write? As in, of halogen is possible. when electron withdrawing group is at ortho and para positions
done everyone is on official me done sir done now right a conclusion here that when we have sn of halo arene at room temperature it is not possible hai na plus mark when you have drastic condition meaning high temperature and high pressure then it is possible when you have electron withdrawing group theek hai electron withdrawing group kahan pe ortho meta and para so when it is at ortho possible meta not possible para possible theek hai I will write the reactions. We have a halorin plus aqueous KOH. Since here we don't have any electron withdrawing group, we have to give drastic conditions. Six twenty three Kelvin, and we have to give three hundred atm pressure. Okay. at this condition the chlorine atom will be replaced by oh and we will get phenol and we have the same chlorine atom plus aqueous kvh but here we have one no2 group we have to give here some heat don't have to remember the conditions okay and you will get Okay, so this is phenol, and we have added added a nitro group, NO two. NO two is in the second position. This is first position. This is second position. So this is two nitro phenol. We have your chlorine. We have your NO two, and we have here one more NO two at the para position. Let's add some KOH. Or you can use any H also. Okay, you give some heat, but this heat heat should be less than the above. Okay, some heat process, but it is not at room temperature. So it is not at room temperature. Some heat is given, and it is also not as high as six twenty three. So it is not drastic condition. Okay, here we have O H. So this is phenol. Two nitro, four nitro as it is. So this will be one two comma four dinitrophenol. At last, we have chlorine atom with three NO two groups. Plus aqueous KOH, giving some heat. No, this room temperature will be higher. Don't have to give much heat. Little pressure will be required, but still. Don't write the condition, then it's just fine. So we have NO two, NO two, NO two, and then OH here. This OH is not phenol, and we have NO two at one, two position, fourth position, and sixth position. So this is two comma four comma six trinitro phenol, also known as picric acid. छापिए जल्दी जल्दी छापिए
लिख लिया आप लोगों ने ये सोना पीस चल रही डन सर डन ओके so this is the end of chemical properties of alkyl halogens now there is one topic which is known as stereochemistry of sn1 and sn2 so usme we have to learn about a few things first then only we can understand what is stereochemistry and what are those now you have heard of this term that is known as isomers right yes or no all of you have heard of isomers yes or no yes yes sir kya hota hai isomers isomers are those molecules which have पढ़ा था आप लोग को कृष्णा कुलसम सही था रुपया आप लोग कुछ बताइए याद होता वॉट आर आई सुमर्स compounds that have same number of atoms so h2s or h2o isomers are so same chemical formula but different uh, arrangement or structure of uh, different structure different dikhe i mean ye sahi hai lekin ab structure and uh, structure jo hai na स्ट्रक्चर के बारे में हम लोग को कितना पता लाइक हाउ मच डू वी नो एंड हाउ हाउ मच कैन वी क्लासिफाई अबाउट स्ट्रक्चर फॉर एग्जांपल अगर आप ये बोले यू हैव टू कार्बन आइटम्स ए बी बी ए ओके या भी अगर अगेन टू कार्बन आइटम्स ए ए एंड बी बी ठीक है नाउ इफ आई आस्क यू दिस इस कार्बन के पास क्या है ए एंड बी दिस कार्बन आल्सो हैज ए एंड बी दिस कार्बन आल्सो हैज ए एंड बी दिस कार्बन सो बोथ ऑफ दिस स्ट्रक्चर मे सीम सेम क्लास टेन तक आपको ये सेम भी लगता होगा नाउ यू गेट अ न्यू परसपेक्टिव कि यहाँ पे जो ए का डिस्टेंस है इट इज अट स्मॉल एंड हियर द ए डिस्टेंस इज अट स्मॉल एंड ड्यू टू विच देर विल बी सम डिफरेंस इन द प्रॉपर्टी ड्यू टू विच देर विल बी सम डिफरेंस इन द प्रॉपर्टी सो जो आइसोमर्स का रियल डेफिनेशन है दैट इज वॉट आर आइसोमर्स शायद अब हमजा को याद आए सेम फॉर्मूला सेम मॉलिकुलर फॉर्मूला केमिकल फॉर्मूला ठीक है सेम फॉर्मूला बट डिफरेंट प्रॉपर्टीज बिकॉज देखिए जनरली वी डोंट डील विद डायरेक्ट स्ट्रक्चर है ना प्रॉपर्टीज देखते बॉइलिंग पॉइंट मेल्टिंग पॉइंट ओके दीज थिंग्स दे डिटरमाइन द प्रॉपर्टी दीज थिंग्स दीज आर प्रॉपर्टीज बॉइलिंग पॉइंट मेल्टिंग पॉइंट एक्सेट्रा इफ दीज टू स्ट्रक्चर देवन हैव डिफरेंट बॉइलिंग पॉइंट दैट मीन दीज स्ट्रक्चर इट सेल्फ आर डिफरेंट ये सर नो इवन दो द सेम फॉर्मुला इज प्रेजेंट करेक्ट है कि नहीं इफ द बॉइलिंग पॉइंट ऑफ दीज टू आर डिफरेंट दैट मीन दिस होल स्ट्रक्चर एंड होता है cis isomers and trans isomers mein there is difference cis isomers isomers they have higher boiling point than trans isomers trans isomer kya hota these are non polar because yahan pe ek dipole hota yahan pe ek dipole hota dipole cancel ho jata sara okay so if they have different boiling points and melting points now this property leads to a thing that okay fine they have same formula everything is same but the properties are different now if the properties are different they are different molecules even if they have the same formula then we went to the structure ki dekhte hain structure kya sa then we went to okay fine structure is same dikh raha hai carbon ka connectivity same hai but the arrangements are different okay so then slowly slowly as the as the perspective of structure increases na dekh ek to starting mein structure kya hota hai jo molecular formula agar aapne dikha to same structure lag raha hai hai na so these are same molecules we will say then we look at the structure if the connectivity is different then they are different structures then we look at the arrangement of atom if the arrangement of atoms are different then it is different structures okay so as the perspective and the concept of structure increases there we say that okay fine ye ye classification but this classification came into being only when we saw there are different properties okay so isomers are what isomers they will have same formula but different properties and this different property by is will be by the virtue of what by the virtue of different structures okay due to different structure theek okay. hai now similarly there is a very abstract uh, concept अच्छा इफ यू रिमेम्बर क्लास इलेवेंथ में यू रिमेम्बर लाइक देर वॉज मेनी रिएक्शन मेनी रिएक्शन नहीं मेनी एक्सपेरिमेंट्स ऑन लाइट जो आपने केमिस्ट्री में पढ़ा होगा कैसा होना स्ट्रक्चर ऑफ एटम कैथोड रेट यू सो एट दैट पॉइंट ऑफ टाइम पीपल वेर एक्सपेरिमेंटिंग वेरी मच ऑन लाइट 
Okay, very much on light. And at that time, we know that light has waves and all. Right? It is having wave nature. And they were learning about different types of light and the interaction of light with different things. When you light, mila, they had one thing which is known as plane polarized light. Okay, plane polarized light. What does it mean? Plane polarized means it moves only in one direction. Moves only in, it has only one frequency, a one frequency may move like that. Okay, that is plane polarized light. For example, let me show you. I have something there. Just a second, it's moving. Yeah. Can you see this? Yes, sir. Okay. So see this thing here, it is only allowing the horizontal line wave to pass. Okay. So the vertical ones are not passing. See, it is horizontal, it is passing. The vertical ones are not passing. Similarly here, the horizontal ones are passing, but if I increase the, if I change the angle here, look slowly, the angle of the light is also getting changed. So around you will see 60 degrees here. It is completely now, it is what? It is completely perpendicular now. And slowly, 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 why it is now? No light is passing from here because this is allowing what light? It is allowing only the horizontal light. Sorry, only the vertical light to pass and the horizontal ones will not be passing. Huh? That means we have a light in one plane. Either it is vertical or it is horizontal. Initially, the lights, the electric field of light, it is what it is on all directions. Okay, it, it is present in all the directions. And when we have some kind of polarizer, it polarizes the light and it allows the light of only one direction. Okay, so please write a few things. You write here, first of all, the topic optical isomers. Mouse and I went annotation tools. Optical isomers. The isomers. The isomer which rotates the plane polarized light. I'll be referring this to PPL. This says PPL, plane polarized light in clockwise or anti clockwise direction is called optical isomer. These are also called optically active compounds. Okay. So initially we will have unpolarized light. Unpolarized light comes up. They will have electric and magnetic field in all the direction. Okay, so this unpolarized. Right. 
when you pass this through a when you pass this through a polarizer for polarizer we use nicole prism nicole prism is generally shown like this okay nicole prism what happens we get a plane polarized light that means we have oscillate only in one direction it is oscillating only in one direction this is what this is plane polarized light ppl further when this plane polarized light it is passed through an organic solvent okay this passed through an organic solvent that means here what we are having some organic molecule in liquid state we have organic solvent ऑर्गेनिक्स ओके ये तो आपका क्या है पीपीएल दिस इज ऑर्गेनिक सोल्यूशन वेन इट पासिस थ्रू ऑर्गेनिक सोल्यूशन एंड द प्लेन पोलराइज लाइक दैट वी हैव यूर let us say it rotates a bit chalo to rotate nahi hota rotate ko humko likhna hi padega Okay, so it has rotated a bit. Initially, it was in this position. It is rotated by angle theta or alpha. So we can say this. Okay, theta or alpha. It has rotated anti-clockwise. It is rotated what? Anti-clockwise. And or it rotates clockwise. It is still plane polarized light, but it has rotated a bit. Okay, it is still plane polarized light, but it has rotated a bit. This is again alpha or theta. This has rotated clockwise direction. Anna, this is rotated clockwise direction. So when it rotates in the clockwise direction, it is known as the D form dextro tro rotate dextro rotatory, or we call it as D form, or we call it as plus form. This is levo rotatory. This is known as L form or the minus form. Okay, so then you have. organic solution organic solution rotates clockwise then the molecule is known as what dextro rotatory or we say that it is in the d form or we say that it is in the plus form when the organic solution it rotates anti clockwise then what do we say it is in the levo rotatory it is levo rotatory l e v o r o t a t a okay sorry 
और एल फॉर्म और माइनस फॉर्म ठीक है कार्बन कार्बन विच है four different groups attached four different groups attached are called asymmetric carbon डेफिनेशन टर्म इज कायरल और कायरल कंपाउंड और मॉलिक्यूल कायरल मॉलिक्यूल व्हाट इज कायरल मॉलिक्यूल द मॉलिक्यूल व्हिच इज नॉट सुपर इंपॉसिबल on its mirror image which is not super impossible on its mirror image is called chiral molecule देखिए okay. कायरल के कुछ एग्जांपल्स आप देख लीजिए सिंपल फॉर एग्जांपल इफ यू हैव लेटर ए ओके दिस लेटर ए इफ आई रोटेट दिस टू गेट द मिरर इमेज इट इज स्टिल ए ना ये दोनों मिरर इमेज है दिस इज स्टिल ए बट इफ यू लुक एट बी ओके एंड आई हैव द मिरर इमेज इसका मिरर इमेज कैसा होगा दिख रहा है आपको इट इज इट इज नॉट बी इट इज नॉट सुपर इम्पोसिबल वट इज दिस इज सुपर इम्पोसिबल दिस इज नॉट सुपर इम्पोसिबल अब हमने तीन चीज देखी है 
we have seen optical isomers we have seen asymmetric carbon and we have seen chiral molecule what is the relation so uh, what is the relation that uh, optical isomer ke liye necessary or sufficient condition kya hai please write necessary and sufficient condition the necessary and sufficient condition for optical isomer is non superimposable on its mirror image ठीक है कार्बन होता है मॉलिक्यूल विच हैज ए सीमेट्रिक कार्बन इट कैन हैव इफ इट हैज ओनली वन एसिमेट्रिक कार्बन एसिमेट्रिक कार्बन को हम लोग सी स्टार से दिखाते हैं इट इज गोइंग टू बी ऑलवेज ऑप्टिकली एक्टिव दैट मीन्स इट इज गोइंग टू रोटेट द प्लेन पोलराइज लाइट एंड इफ वी हैव इफ वी हैव टू सी स्टार्स ठीक है यानी कि दो एसिमेट्रिक कार्बन है अगर हमारे पास हैविंग टू एसिमेट्रिक कार्बन देन दो कंडीशन इफ बोथ द एसिमेट्रिक कार्बन हैव सेम ग्रुप्स ठीक है बिल्कुल सेम ग्रुप्स हैं दे हैव सेम ग्रुप्स then it may be or may not be so kuch hum bata nahi sakte okay it may be or may not be may or may not be optically active isme hum log kya karna padega dono ka we have to make the structure draw it properly then draw the mirror image and then we will have to look whether it is impossible super impossible or not super impossible sirf so, structure dekh ke hum log nahi bata sakte is case okay so we have to look at the uh whole molecule now if it is having different groups it is having different groups then it is going to be always optically active ठीक है। सेम ग्रुप्स में ना आपको हम एग्जांपल 
लिख देते हैं यहाँ पे फॉर uh, एग्जाम्पल मान लीजिए आपके पास अगर सेम ग्रुप से इस तरह से क्लोरीन हाइड्रोजन एंड लेट से यू हैव हियर यहाँ पे सी एस थ्री कर दीजिए तो सी एस थ्री कर दीजिए यहाँ क्लोरीन कर दीजिए जनरली कार्बन आइटम रहता है ऊपर और नीचे सी एस थ्री हाइड्रोजन एंड क्लोरीन ओके सो दिस इज गोइंग टू बी अगर इसका हम ये बनाएंगे ना मिरर इमेज सो वो सुपर इम्पोजिबल होगा एंड ऑल्सो बिकॉज इट हैजेट्रिक सो दिस मॉडिफिक इज सिमेट्रिकल इट इज नॉट गोइंग टू रोटेट दिस विल बी वॉट दिस हैव सेम ग्रुप्स एंड दिस विल बी नॉट ऑप्टिकली एक्टिव लेकिन यहीं पे अगर आपका ओरिएंटेशन चेंज हो जाए कुछ इस तरह से बिल्कुल सेम है बिल्कुल ओके सी एस थ्री यहाँ पे क्लोरीन आ गया यहाँ पे हाइड्रोजन आ गया यहाँ पे क्लोरीन आ गया यहाँ पे हाइड्रोजन आ गया तो वी हैव डन ओनली वन रोटेशन दिस इज ऑप्टिकली एक्टिव ठीक है बिकॉज इट इज नॉट हैविंग एनी काइंड ऑफ सिमेट्री इसका अगर आप मेरा इमेज बनाएगा तो वो सुपर इम्पोजिबल नहीं होगा फिर ओके तो सेम में आपके पास इस तरह का है। When it is uh, different groups, then it is going to be always। ये दो कार्बन है ना आपकी दीज आर ए सीमेट्रिक कार्बन राइट दीज आर कार्बन ये अभी दिखाते हैं आप लोगों को हाउ टू विल गिव सम एग्जाम्पल्स डोंट वरी Then everyone is on a piece of me. As Hamza, Hiba, Krishna. Done, sir. Okay. One second. Need some examples. Suppose we have carbon, CH3, chlorine, and hydrogen. Okay, this is C2H5. ठीक है, C2H5. बताइए, यहाँ पे देखिए इस कार्बन के पास क्या है? It has a group which is. Please see the groups like this. It has a group CH3, another group is hydrogen, and this is also another group chlorine, and then we have another group which is C2H5. So all of the four, all of the groups are different. Yes or no? Please tell me. All of these are different. Yes. Yes or no? Hamza, Heba, Krishna. Yes. Right. So this is what optically active or inactive? क्या होगा ये? Optically. Yeah. देखिए, this molecule इसको हमने ऐसे दिखाया है बार. ये molecule क्या है पता है? One, two, three, four carbon atoms, right? C two, four carbon atoms, and chlorine in the second carbon atom like this. Okay, so this is optically active. Got this? Yes or no? Please tell me. Yes. Okay. What is it? Tell me. Suppose we have something like this. Here, in between, you have what? OH. So, what do you think? चार ग्रुप इसमें तो तीन ग्रुप सीख रहे हैं आपको व्हाट विल बी द फोर्थ ग्रुप टेल मी व्हाट विल बी द फोर्थ ग्रुप इस कार्बन पे कौन सा होगा चौथा नहीं आ रहा नहीं आ रहा टर्न योर माइक ऑन हमजा हिबा कृष्णा और अफीफ प्लीज टर्न योर माइक ऑन अरे प्लीज टर्न योर माइक ऑन हां अब इसमें बताना है Is this molecule ये optically active है और it is optically not active ठीक है हमजा हिबा कृष्णा yes sir not tell me 
ठीक है तो कैसे देखेंगे वॉट डू वी नीड वी नीड एट लीस्ट वन कार्बन वन ए सिमेट्रिक कार्बन लिख लेते हैं एक हमको क्या चाहिए ए सिमेट्रिक कार्बन वॉट इज ए सिमेट्रिक कार्बन ए सिमेट्रिक कार्बन इज कार्बन विथ फोर डिफरेंट ग्रुप्स है ना कार्बन के तो कितने होते हैं इट कैन हैव थ्री बॉन्ड्स थ्री ग्रुप्स वन ऑफ दो ग्रुप शुड बी डिफरेंट इज दैट अंडरस्टूड यस नो हम साइन हिबा ठीक है अब इस कार्बन में बताइए दिस इज द फर्स्ट कार्बन कौन कौन से ग्रुप है फर्स्ट कार्बन में What are the groups on the first carbon? Tell me. Draw it, draw it. Banana, banana. You have to copy it. Banana, first. Let me know when you are done making this molecule in your notebook. लिख लिया यस हमजा हिबा कृष्णा डन सर ठीक है नो प्लीज टेल मी हमजा हिबा एक ग्रुप तो हम बता दे रहे हैं जो ग्रुप आप लोग को दिख रहा है पहले कार्बन है ना पहला कार्बन हम इसमें आते हैं फर्स्ट कार्बन आइटम एंड इट दिस होल ग्रुप Yes or no? Correct. Hamza, Heba, Krishna. Please stand here. Yes. Sir. Oh, mic. Yes. Sir. Mic on. करके रखिए आप लोग please. Hamza, Heba. Yes. Sir. Krishna. ठीक है. अब बताइए. बाकी के चार group होते हैं ना carbon के पास. It has four bonds. So it is bonded with what atoms? What groups? बाकी के. बाकी के तीन क्या हैं? The hydrogen. अरे तो Hamza, Heba आप लोग को ये नहीं बात पता थी? हाँ? हमजा yes, तो बोलते क्यों नहीं हो हाँ मॉर्निंग इन क्या है यहाँ पे हाइड्रोजन है बताइए ये कार्बन ए सिमेट्रिक है यस और नो नो सर ए सिमेट्रिक फिर हम अच्छा ठीक है कृष्णा अब आपको आगे समझ में ठीक है आप उसके बाद इसमें बता दीजिएगा ये पूरा का पूरा देख के अभी आप चुप रही है ठीक है कृष्णा ये हमजा ने भाई होटल में हमजा एसिमेट्रिक या नॉट एसिमेट्रिक डोंट नो भी बोल सकते तीसरा ऑप्शन है आई एम नॉट गेटिंग योर वॉइस हमजा आई कॉन्ट केयर यू सॉरी नॉट एसिमेट्रिक नॉट एसिमेट्रिक ओके हे बा एसिमेट्रिक और नॉट एसिमेट्रिक यस हिबा हिबा कैन यू प्लीज टेल दी आंसर फास्ट या तो आप चैट में लिख दीजिए ओके दिस सेकेंड कार्बन आइटम इसके पास कौन से ग्रुप्स हैं इट हैज दिस सी एस थ्री ग्रुप्स एंड दिस Whole group here. What are the other two atoms or groups? Tell me. Sir, hydrogens. Hydrogens. Symmetric or asymmetric? Hamza, tell me. Symmetric or asymmetric? Second one. Just symmetric. Symmetric, is it? It is. सिमेट्रिक एंड एसिमेट्रिक नहीं है मतलब लेट अस लुक एट दिस थर्ड वन थर्ड वन के पास अभी हम इसको इरेज कर देते हैं देयर इज दिस ग्रुप हियर एंड देयर इज दिस ग्रुप हियर और एक ओएच OH है आपके पास व्हाट इज द फोर्थ वन चौथा कौन सा है व्हाट इज द फोर्थ वन एच हाइड्रोजन अब बताइए सिमेट्रिक एसिमेट्रिक सर एसिमेट्रिक 
बिहारी ए सिमेट्रिक अरे ये दोनों तो सेम है सिर्फ हाइड्रोजन ही सेम हो सकता है क्या हाँ फंस गए ना सी हमजा बाकी कृष्णा वर्ड आपने क्या सोचा था सिमेट्रिक्स हो जाता आप भी फंस गए दिख रहा है कि नहीं दिख रहा है हमजा हेबा कृष्णा ये सोनो पीसल मी यस अब दिख रहा है हमजा दैट इट इज सिमेट्रिक यस है ना दिस इज सिमेट्रिक बाकी फिर ये दोनों तो क्या होंगे सिमेट्रिक ही होंगे यानी कि दिस मॉलिक्यूल इज व्हाट इट इज नॉट ऑप्टिकली एक्टिव इट इज नॉट ऑप्टिकली एक्टिव चलिए थर्ड वाला बताइए आपको क्लोरीन अरे ये तो क्या समझ में ब्रोमीन मत लीजिए आप आपकी जो आपका जो एनसीआर है ना उसमें आपको बस देखना पड़ेगा कि कोई एक भी एसिमेट्रिक है कि नहीं आप लोग बस ये देख लीजिए कि एक एसिमेट्रिक हो जाए ओके वन इज एसिमेट्रिक मीजो वाला केस आप लोगों को उतना जनरली दिया नहीं जाएगा हमजा एंड हेबा प्लीज सेंड योर आंसर इन चैट अच्छा भाई तो मैंने आपको ये बताना था इस ये ऑप्टिकली एक्टिव होगा नहीं होगा क्या लिखा है नॉट ऑप्टिकली एक्टिव हमजा बताइए आप ये पहला वाला कार्बन कायरल है ये दिस इज ए सिमेट्रिक और सिमेट्रिक फर्स्ट कार्बन इज ये समझा सेकंड कार्बन सिमेट्रिक सिमेट्रिक थर्ड कार्बन थर्ड कार्बन हम सब तो फिर जब ये एक एक और ये वाला लास्ट कार्बन सिमेट्रिक तो बताइए ना आपको एक एक सिमेट्रिक मिल गया बताइए वन ए सिमेट्रिक कार्बन ऑलवेज ऑप्टिकली एक्टिव ना Yes. फिर आपने कैसे बोल दिया नॉट ऑप्टिकली एक्टिव ये बताइए
optically active, not active. आपका आंसर नहीं आ रहा है बट जस्ट टेल मी राइट नाउ वॉट इज दंसर आई डोंट नो अरे क्या हो गया चलिए ठीक है रेडो टॉपिक इन एंड Other enantiomers, the non-superimposable. Mirror images are called. Enantiomers. Some note about it. the enantiomer they will always exist in pair they always exists exist in pairs okay the carbon br cl hydrogen oh to so, iska kya ho jayega br carbon oh hydrogen cl meter image to ye dono ka relation kya hai Enantiomers. These are enantiomers. Okay. Physically, how are these different? So you will write. They have same molecular formula. but rotates the plane polarized light in different directions okay mani ji agar eight clockwise ghuma de raha hai to dusra anti clockwise ghuma dega okay they acha uh, ek to ye different honge but they will uh, rotate in the same angle mani ji one is rotating the plane polarized light in the clockwise direction 30 degree to jo uska dusra enantiomer hoga to mirror image hoga it will rotate anti clockwise lekin same 30 degree mein okay same 30 degree mein that means the alpha is going to be seen that is getting to usme se ek d hoga dusra l hoga okay जो क्लॉकवाइज कर रहा है डी एंटी क्लॉकवाइज विल बी एल डन देखिए आप लोग रेसमिक मिक्सचर व्हाट इज रेसमिक मिक्सचर द इफीमोल मिक्सचर ऑफ D and L form which do not rotate the plane polarized light due to external compensation is called rhythmic mixture
है ना देखिए मान लीजिए आपके पास दोनों है एक क्या कर रहा है देर इज वी हैव सोल्यूशन इन विच वी हैव द डी फॉर्म डी फॉर्म इट इज रोटेटिंग क्लॉक वाइज एल फॉर्म इट इज रोटेटिंग एंटी क्लॉक वाइज सेम एंगल है ना इक्वीमर मिक्सर ऑफ डी एंड एल फॉर्म ऑफ द सेम कंपाउंड उसमें क्या होगा दोनों This D1 is getting compensated by the L1. The L1 is getting compensated by the D1. That is why we are writing it is due to the external compensation. The molecule D form is getting compensated by the L form externally. Okay, that is known as external compensation. Due to external compensation, is called racemic mixture. You understand this? Why this will this mixture is not going to rotate the plane polarized line. D and L form individually they rotate, but the mixture. Due to the compensation of D and L form, it is not rotating. Sanjay, may I ask you a question? Yes or no? Hamza and Hiba, Krishna. Yes, sir. What about you guys, Hamza and Hiba? Yes. Yes, na. No? Then you will write. Yes, and one gives. Racemic mixture. Now let us see. Oh. I am taking a molecule, carbon, with X atom, hydrogen atom here, and a CH three group here. Now these are all of these molecules. All of these atoms are in group. Sorry, are in plane, same plane. And after that, hydrogen is on the back side. we have another group which is c2h5 this is coming out of the plane ye bataiye hamza and hiba i hope you guys know na wedge and dash hamza and hiba sorry sir ye pata hai na ye it is inside the plane ye dash use karte outside the plane tetrahedral structure ke liye nahi bhul gaye yes sir yaad hai na krishna what about you Yes, sir. Okay. So the first step in SN one is what? Formation of carbocation. When the carbocation will be formed, it will be cleaner. So what will happen? The C two H five will be like this. Now, so clean will join, or it will be cleaner structure. You will have trigonal cleaner structure. Here, you have. What will happen? Hydrogen, you can write. Here, 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 you can write. And there is a p orbital which is vacant here. P orbital is vacant here. Carbocation बना है. P orbital क्या होगा? Vacant होगा. Positive charge. Now since this p orbital has two lobes, the nucleophile can attack on on both the sides. What can the nucleophile do? Nucleophile can attack either from here and give the electrons on this p orbital, or it can. अटैक फ्रॉम हियर ऑल्सो क्योंकि एक तो न्यूक्लियोफाइल होगा नहीं बहुत सारे ढेरों न्यूक्लियोफाइल होंगे दोनों तरफ से अटैक होगा एंड इफ इट अटैक्स ऑन दिस डायरेक्शन तो आपके पास जो प्रोडक्ट आएगा इट विल बी अ न्यूक्लियोफाइल अटैच विद कार्बन एटम दिस CS3 विल बी स्टिल ऑन द प्लेन दिस हाइड्रोजन एटम विल आल्सो बी स्टिल ऑन बैक साइड एंड दिस C2H5 विल बी हियर But as you can see, what has happened? The direction has changed. So this is known as inversion. Inversion of configuration. So initially, X was here. Pura invert ho gaya na. All of the groups they were what in the left side. Now they are all on the right side. Now if it is attacking from, let me write it like this. Let's come to red color. Let's give it. Or let's give it green color. Let's give it. Okay. So this is what. रिएक्टेंट केस में हाइड्रोजन सी टू एच फाइव Here we are having CH three. This is retention. That means the configuration of the configuration of what the configuration of 
क्या बोलते हैं रिएक्टेंट इज रिटेन थोड़ा छोटा कर देते हैं इन्वर्जन यहां लिख दिया हमने टेंशन लिख दिया हमने बिल्कुल आपको अब नजर आ रहा होगा दैट बोथ ऑफ दीज आर वॉट मेरर इमेजेस ये सोनो एंड ये भी आपका फिफ्टी परसेंट होगा ये भी आपका फिफ्टी परसेंट होगा and they will be in mixture so this is racemic mixture and what are these two these two are enantiomers of each other डन यस एन ऑफ मी डन सर अब लिखिए आप एक चीज इनवर्स कॉन्फिग्रेशन द रिएक्शन इन विच कॉन्फिग्रेशन ऑफ प्रोडक्ट is just opposite to that of the reactant is called inverse configuration and the process is called inversion theek okay? hai like sn2 leads to inversion in configuration इसी मॉलिक्यूल को लेके आते हैं चेक कैन यू स्कॉल बिट अप हाँ करते करते कुछ आपको स्ट्रक्चर दिखाने में शायद कुछ याद आ जाए नहीं केमिकल बॉन्डिंग में था ना वेट सेकंड केमिकल बॉन्डिंग मॉलिक्यूल और बैटल थ्योरी देखिए ये दिख रहा है आप लोगों को यस आया ना 
ठीक है तो ये कैसे हुआ पी पी के मिलने से बनाया राइट ये सोनो पी और बैटल एंड पी और बैटल मेकिंग दिस टाइप ऑफ स्ट्रक्चर अब देखिए वॉट इज दिस दिस इज द बी एम ओ है ना और ये देखिए ये क्या है ए बी एम ओ हमजा हिबा याद आ रहा है आप लोग को ये सोनो हमजा ही नेबा yes, है ना ठीक है बिल्कुल ध्यान से देखिए और आपको पता है एबीएमओ में वी डोंट पुट इलेक्ट्रॉन है ना बीएमओ हैज अ लोअर एनर्जी बीएमओ का लोअर एनर्जी लोअर एनर्जी देखिए यहां पे सिग्मा का लोअर एनर्जी एबीएमओ का ऊपर एनर्जी है ठीक है तो सेम थिंग हम बना रहे हैं आपके पास सी एक्स के लिए ध्यान से देखिएगा फिर सी एन एक्स कार्बन हो गया हाइड्रोजन हो गया एक यहाँ पे एक यहाँ पे ओके एंड हियर हियर वी हैव बॉन्ड दैट मींस क्या होगा एक इलेक्ट्रॉन इसका यहाँ पे और हाइड्रोजन से एक इलेक्ट्रॉन मिलेगा दिस ए बी एम ओ विल बी वेकेंट शेप की अगर हम बात करें कार्बन दिस विल बी द शेप ऑफ बॉन्डिंग मॉलिकुलर और बैटरी तो यहां पे इस तरह से आपके पास क्या निकला रहेगा एंटी बॉन्डिंग मॉलिकुलर और बैटरी ये सर नो क्लियर है सब हमजा हिबा वॉट अबाउट यू गई clear okay now see the nucleophile to yahan pe to aapke paas atom electron dal hi sakta hai bonding orbital mein bmo mein it can only add electrons on abmo okay so what it will do abmo aapka yahan pe just back side of x hai na carbon ke sath yahan pe kya hai x hai to yahan pe we have the anti bonding molecular orbital which is vacant where the nucleophile can put its electron so the nucleophile has no option and obviously you can see that this is on the plane this is behind the plane and this is the front of the plane so agar aap is tarah se bataiye na so you will get some kind of cone type of structure yes or no correct hai yes sir right and you can see that there is a space from where the nucleophile can attack so the nucleophile With its electron, it attacks on the carbon atom from back side. It can only attack from the back side. Now, when it attacks on the black back side, what will happen? Slowly, it is putting the electrons on the anti-bonding molecular orbital of carbon, and the carbon slowly it is removing the electrons from its bonding molecular orbital, and it is giving to its X. Okay, it is giving to its X. Now, what is happening? As soon as the nucleophile, once it it makes a bond with carbon atom. the other groups which are present here they have to flip they go like this ch3 hydrogen and c2h5 okay so as you can see this is what this has led to inversion in configuration inversion in configuration okay this is back side attack theek hai chapi isko छाप लीजिए जरा एस एन और एस एन टू का डिफरेंस है ना इस तरह से दोबारा सभी चीज लिखा हुआ आपके इसमें 
कॉपी करने वक्त आपको अगर कुछ तकलीफ हो मतलब इफ यू डोंट अंडरस्टैंड समथिंग देन लेट मी नो ओके, सो द फर्स्ट वन आपको एक चीज ध्यान रखिएगा प्लीज द रेट लॉ इज वॉट इट इज यूनिमोलिकुलर ओके यू आइडर राइट यूनिमोलिकुलर और यू राइट आर इज इक्वल टू के इन टू आर एक्स ठीक है दोनों लिखिएगा तो दो अलग पॉइंट नहीं गिनाएंगे विल बी द सेम पॉइंट ओनली ओके रिमेम्बर दैट So what's the last point after attack uh, at below attack? Zero chemistry. <clears throat> Also note down the homework. So tomorrow, see uh, the whole chapter is done. Ah, uh, एक और चीज़ बच बचा हुआ है आपका. Right, the uh, polyhalogen. 
कंपाउंड्स ठीक है पॉलीहैलोजन कंपाउंड्स आप लोग करिएगा इट्स जस्ट वन नहीं इट्स टू पेजेस वन शीट हाँ टू पेजेस इन एनसीईआरटी यू हैव सिक्स पॉलीहैलोजन कंपाउंड्स दैट यू हैव टू नो अबाउट ओके और सवाल वहां से भी आते हैं ओके इन So I think I have somewhere from around twenty thirteen or twenty fourteen to twenty twenty. Okay. So in this, I will add the question paper of twenty twenty two. Okay. Because twenty twenty one means move on either paper. I hope you guys remember second wave that was time. So my paper niwa tha twenty twenty two ke two ke ham add karke I will give it to you guys. Okay. There will be a plenty of questions. Plenty, matlab plenty. So, what are all these topics? Topics? I mean, uh, you wrote below homework. Ah, reaction maps. Reaction maps, पता है आपको? क्या होते हैं? कृष्णा, बोल के. नहीं तो सिर्फ आपके बारे में है. जब हमने खत्म किया था. प्रिपरेशन जब खत्म किया था हमने फिजिकल प्रॉपर्टी है ये दिख रहा है यस ये है रिएक्शन में आप ओके तो आपके पास क्या होना चाहिए ये होना चाहिए प्रिपरेशन के लिए ठीक है जो भी आपके पास मेथड ऑफ प्रिपरेशन है और केमिकल प्रॉपर्टीज आरएक्स के आपके पास पूरा एक रिएक्शन में प्रिपरेशन का एक रिएक्शन में केमिकल प्रॉपर्टीज का ओके एंड देन वन रिएक्शन में विल बी ऑफ अरे आप तो समझ गए होंगे ना कुछ भी बताने की जरूरत है समझ गए क्या करना है कृष्ण सुन सुन यस ठीक है तो कल बिना इसके मत आइएगा राइट ऑल द रिएक्शन आपके पास एक जगह कंडेंस होने चाहिए है ना इंडिया टू सेंड इट टू मी बिफोर द क्लास सो द लास्ट वन सॉरी लास्ट में नो सर फिफ्थ या पॉलीहैलोजन कंपाउंड्स एनसीईआरटी का एक्सरसाइज से पहले आप दो पेज जाइएगा यू विल हैव अ टॉपिक पॉलीहैलोजन कंपाउंड्स ओके सो यू हैव टू मेक शॉर्ट नोट्स ऑन देम दो पेज है बस इट इज कम्प्लीटली थियोरिटिक ओके कृष्णा ओके सर दीज आर दाइव थिंग्स डू 